Robinson. Hello, Mike. Got something for you. Jerry, what's happened? Ah, oh, shucks, Grandpa. I didn't... I mean, I was just there at this place and... Well, you... Just a minute. Now, Mike, you tell me what happened. Just a little ruckus down near the Manson factory. One of those soapbox fellas gets up and starts hollering down with this and down with that and down with capitalism and down with old man Manson. And then some guy threw something and the fight started. Boy, was it swell. Hmm, I dare say. There was Jerry in the middle of it all, so I took him into protective custody, you might say. Oh, gosh, Grandpa, I wasn't doing it. Anyway, I thought I'd better bring him home before he got into more trouble. And I'm mighty glad you did. Mike. Thanks a lot. Oh, twat anything. With them six boys of mine, they're the minute's peace anywhere. So it was fun, eh, son? Oh, sure, Gramps. Boy, but old man Manson saw when he finds out. He thinks he's the most important guy in town. Well, guess we showed him. Wait a minute, Jerry. Old man Manson may not be any more important than a lot of men. But you are like that Manson's factory is pretty near the most important thing in this town. What do you mean, Gramps? Let's take a walk. And I'll tell you. It's like this, son. Some people can say a lot of crazy things and make a lot of rumpus. And I suppose it seems like fun to you. Well, it sounded like a good idea at the time. I suppose so. Well, there are a lot of people who seem to think that it's smart to criticize an established institution, like the factory. But you want to remember this, son. Anybody can criticize. Anybody can be destructive. But you ought to know what it is you're talking about before you talk. Ah, the man on the soapbox explained everything. Now, he said... Yes, I know what he said. But you weren't there, Gramps. No, but I've been there before. I've heard these terror downers. And I know the one thing that man didn't tell you was the truth about the Manson factory. Well, what do you mean? Well, son, that factory isn't just a building of bricks and steel. It's more than that. Far more. It's your town. My town? Well, gee, how do you figure that? Aren't you paper, Mr. Robinson? Oh, thanks, Bobby. Let's sit down here. Now, I'll tell you something about this town of ours, Jerry. 